Hello and welcome to part 5 of my Spider-Man cosplay series. In this video I'll sew the shirt together, sew the shirt to the pants, and sew in a three-way U-shaped zipper system. So I started by sewing the red front piece to the blue side pieces. As with the rest of this project, I used a zigzag stitch on my sewing machine and sewed over all the seams twice for extra strength. These pieces can be tricky because of the corners. So I'll link some tutorials on how to sew corners in the description. After that, I sewed the two blue side arm pieces to the red arm piece. Next I sewed an invisible zipper along the wrist using a straight stitch, only on the red section. They are optional, but I would highly recommend putting wrist zippers in your suit, so that you can take your hands out to use your phone or eat without having to take off the whole suit. Next I sewed the base of the palm, making sure to fold the wrist zipper out of the way. I think the pattern comes with finger gussets, but I decided not to use them, and instead just sewed the top and bottom hand pieces together. This was one of the most difficult parts to sew, so just go slow and make sure it's all lined up properly. Then, you should have a glove. I then sewed up the rest of the arm, again making sure to fold the wrist zipper out of the way. I repeated all of that for the other arm. Next, I sewed an invisible zipper down the middle of the two red upper back pieces. I then sewed the back of the arms to the red upper back piece. Next I sewed the top of the blue back piece to the bottom of the red upper back piece, making sure to fold the zipper out of the way. I then sewed the front of the arms to the front piece. Then I sewed the back of the belt closed. Before sewing the rest of the shirt together, I had to first sew it to the pants. Next, I installed a three-way U-shaped zipper system. I will link the video I saw for how to do this in the description. 
The fabric needs to be stretched while sewing the zippers. So before sewing the zippers, I put on the suit and measured the distance from the top of the belt to my armpit and along the back part of the belt. I used these measurements when pinning the fabric. The zipper system starts by sewing two invisible zippers, one on either side of the suit, going from the belt to the armpit. I then sewed the armpits closed, being sure to fold the zipper out of the way. Bet you're not tired of me saying that. I then sewed in a separating zipper. I sewed one side to the bottom of the blue back piece and the other side to the top of the red belt. To make sure they would line up properly, I marked them with a sharpie while the zipper was closed before sewing. After that, all the sewing is finished, and this is the actual base suit itself finished. But it's still missing the spider emblems, the shoes, and some small touch-ups. So stay tuned for that video. And after that will be the final reveal video. And as some of you know, following that my channel will be in a bit of an experimental phase, which I'm really excited about and a little scared. <laughs> Anyway, I'll see you next time.